I'm Danielle Michaud outside Scotiabank Arena, and a lot of people are asking, Co, what is going on? It's not very often you see the Raptors and Blockbuster trade in the same sentence, but that's exactly what exploded this morning in the wee hours. The thing that has a lot of people still trying to digest is that it involves Toronto's face of the franchise. DeRozan, second chance, great. DeMar DeRozan is heading west, joining the San Antonio Spurs along with Jakob Pertl and a protected 2019 draft pick. In return, the six welcomes forward Kawhi Leonard and guard Danny Green. If you aren't familiar with Kawhi, let me hit you with some info. He's an NBA champion back in 2014, where he was also named the Finals MVP. He was also dubbed the top defensive player in the league in 2015 and 2016. Two years ago, he was widely considered one of the top five players in the league, period. Now, injuries have been a significant issue since, sitting out all but nine games last year. His health is certainly the biggest point of concern, but so is his attitude. It was reported he has, quote, no desire to play in Toronto. But he also had no interest in playing in San Antonio anymore, demanding a trade from the storied franchise. DeRozan is equally upset about how things unfolded, posting a salty take on his Instagram story that read, be told one thing and the outcome another. Can't trust him. Ain't no loyalty in this game. Sell you out for a quick little bit of nothing. The thing is, Leonard isn't nothing. With LeBron in Hollywood, the East is for the taking. And Masai Ujiri, as cold-blooded as it feels, was ready to make moves whether it's popular or not. No matter which side you fall on, it's a landmark moment for Canada's only NBA squad. The reaction to this news has been completely overwhelming. In fact, I just met a girl who was walking down this row from Germany, huge NBA fan, and she just had to ask what I thought of the DeRozan trade for Kawhi Leonard. Pretty major stuff. And if you can believe it, for quite a few hours this afternoon, every single trending topic on Twitter in Toronto had to do with the trade. So everybody's talking, including some of DeRozan's former teammates. We'll hear from them a little later. But for now, I'll hand it off to Pam Seidel, who got a feel from some of the heartbroken Toronto fans. I'm Danielle Michaud outside Scotiabank Arena, and DeMar DeRozan is no longer a Toronto Raptor. Man, that is going to take some time to really sink in, and that goes for more than just the fans. Some of his former teammates sounding off on social media about the blockbuster trade this morning for Kawhi Leonard. Damari Carroll says, no matter what, when I think of Toronto Raptors basketball, I think of DeMar DeRozan. He deserves a statue. He's not the only one who felt the four-time All-Star should be bronzed. Terrence Ross writes, Dear fans of Toronto, it's time you guys build a statue of DeMar. Regardless of what happens, he deserves it. Jose Calderon played with DeRozan during the early stages of his career, tweeting, It's going to be hard slash weird checking the Raptors without DeRozan. He is going to be missed. Good luck in your new challenge. You will be even better, amigo. Speaking of friends, his pal Jays pitcher Marcus Stroman posted, man, loved everything about DeMar's game and passion for the city. Going to miss showing up to the ACC, watch him go for 40 with the smoothest mid-range game in the league. Wishing you nothing but the best, my brother. Respect everything you represent and stand for. And of course, Raptors global ambassador and a man simply known as Drake sent out his thoughts on the trade, saying in part in an Instagram post to my brother DeRozan, I want to say 10 million thank yous on behalf of your city. You're a fixture in Toronto forever and you gave everything you had. And to Kawhi, we look forward to this new chapter and we welcome you to the most intense and supportive city in NBA basketball. So one thing's for sure, I said it a little bit earlier and I'll say it again, you cannot deny the impact that DeRozan had both on and off the court in Toronto. But clearly, Masai Ujiri felt this risk was worth taking for a player of the caliber of Leonard coming to this team.